whether you just need some time from burnout or you couldn't make it to your desired university in the first attempt and ended up taking a gap year, here are some ways you could utilize this time productively. Number one, explore uncharted territories. Use this time to try out new things which always intrigued you but you couldn't get the time to do. For example, try out a new sport, learn some new skill, or maybe do some art. Not only would this help you know more about yourself but would also boost your confidence. We at Huser also conduct different skill-based workshops, both free of cost as well as paid, that you can register for. Number two, work. You can get some real-life hands-on experience by applying for internships at different places. This will give you an insight on how things work in the real world. Huser itself offers Husership, which is an internship program for the recent college graduates who are recruited in multiple departments of Huser. Number three, study. As important as these activities are, it's also very crucial to take out some time to study during your gap year for your aptitude test. And since time is not a constraint anymore, you should be able to easily allocate at least one to two hours a day to study and prepare good enough to get into your desired university. And this is where Huser comes in. At Huser, not only do we have the best faculty, but also a state-of-the-art campus with a library which is open to Huser students all days a week. We also offer crash courses which allow the students to prepare for their aptitude tests within six short weeks. Lastly, I hope that you make the best use of this gap year. And good luck for your aptitude tests. Like, follow and share for more.